Hey everyone, how's it going? Today I'm running you through my personal list of my top five underrated drummers. Let's go! At number five, we have Mr. Mike Wengren of Disturbed. Now, no matter what you might think of this guy, he can seriously lay down some heavy metal drumming. He could probably also join the list with Phil Collins for most recognizable drum patterns of all time. Come on, how many of you out there know the intro to Down With The Sickness? It's all because of this guy. Not to mention that back in 2015 at the Loudwire Music Awards, he was nominated as one of the best drummers. Now that's quite an achievement. At number four, we've got System of a Down's very own John Dalmayan. Come on, this guy has laid down some seriously interesting patterns in his career, and they are all highly recognisable. I mean, just check some of these out. He also took an award from Drum Magazine in 2006 as Drummer of the Year. Again, one hell of an achievement. At number three, we've got the backbone of Creed and Alter Bridge, Mr. Scott Phillips. When it comes to talking about underrated drummers, this is seriously one of them. I mean, you only have to listen to Creed's back catalogue to hear some amazing drumming from this guy. Plus the fact, as soon as he went on to Alter Bridge, whoa, it was a different animal. I mean, just check some of these out. Coming in at number two is Limp Biscuit's own John Otto. Now, again, speaking of underrated drummers, how many times has this guy made you want to break stuff? Bad pun, I know, but his drumming speaks for itself every time you've seen him or heard him play. I mean, just check out a few of these classics. Coming in at my top spot of number one is Seven Dust's Morgan Rose. Although he is quite easily recognised by the drumming community, his playing seriously has not received the credit it deserves. The way he plays really changes up the tracks each time you hear it. And yeah, just listen to a few of these. Well, that's my own personal top five list of underrated drummers. And hey, if you disagree with me and you would have put anyone else on this list, leave a comment below telling me who and why. While you're still here, you may have noticed that on the screen now I've actually done reaction videos to a lot of the drummers that are on my list. Pick one. They're all pretty good. I promise. 